Hey guys, Monster Matt here, and welcome back once again to Dark Souls 3. Now, I've returned to wherever this is going to be, probably the boss fight or whatever the next area is going to be in this zone. Ooh. Dashing through, required ahead, huh? Dashing through to where, I wonder? Oh, hello. Who are your friends? You guys do a fair bit of damage. Who knows? Don't give many souls either. I see why they said just dash on through. It makes sense. You've got a sword as well. You got a bow. Or a crossbow, I should say. Oh. I'm understanding the point now. It's an ambush. A big old ambush. So we'll fight our way through it properly at least one time. Really? Also, I have finished upgrading my weapon. It is now... Oh, there's an angry eyes fellow there. I gotta watch it for him. Um, I finished upgrading my sword. It is now a plus 10 Astora Great Sword and Chan with Fire. So it does as much damage as it ever could gonna be doing. Spear. All right. Definitely gonna have to actually dash through in future, though. I just wanted to get his his uh, his item. I say though that having tons of stamina really hasn't changed as like the, the, the swings I can make all that much, which I find a little bit surprising. Like I, I can only hit more, but I guess I was sort of at, at uh, on the edge of it or something before because you can swing about four times the three I could before, you know, which for the investment in stamina I made I kind of think is underwhelming, but it's all good I guess. That's a lot of health. <laughs> all right, made it up top. Oh, there's more of you. Double angry. Wow, okay, the dashing is definitely was, was uh, good advice. No, there's three of you. That is such overkill. Your luck. Your luck. Just roll with it. This way. This way is good. I like this way. Bye. Behold the power of doors. Learn anything from Dork Souls. It was that opening doors makes you invincible. Oh. That sucked. Nope. Could you just knock it off, please? Seriously, you're kind of a jerk. Re-up your mojo so I can kill you. May need to go back and heal and then just actually do the dash through this time around because, holy jeez. I just got bored and left. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Fine. All right, let's just go on ahead and see what's up. I have to come back through here in a, in a, in a, in a bigger hurry than I will. Still have eight S Estus flasks left, which isn't so bad. This looks very final. God required ahead. Oh, good. Be wary of good luck. Help me. Oh yeah, it's gonna be fun. Let's do this. Who am I up against this time? Oh dear. Another dogged contender. What is this, like, 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 like a gladiator pit? What? Welcome, unkindled one. 
purloiner of cinders. Mind you. Oh no. The mantle of Lord interests me none. Not another dancer, is it? The fire linking curse. The legacy of Lords. Let it all fade into nothing. You've done quite enough. Now have your rest. You know what, no, I mean given the crown there, I'm I'm feeling Lori and Elder Prince. Oh my goodness, you teleport. Having a fire sword this moment probably isn't the best thing ever, but Do that on purpose. Works for me. Oh, his next stage is, is he learns how to use his legs. Well, give him props. He learned how to snap a lot faster than Snorlax did. No. You cut that right out there, buddy. Way over there. Yeah. Take that, buddy. All right. All right. All right. So the Elder Prince is down. Does that mean the one who's talking to me is the Younger Prince, or what? Oh, dear brother. Nope. Oh, okay, Younger Prince. I'm on my way. Right, because I've, I've, I've seen things like this before. They, they, they mentioned a Young Prince who was very sickly. Unyielding sword of Lothric's Prince. What are you doing? Why And why aren't I stopping you from doing it? For that is our curse. So wait, as long as one of you is alive, the other one won't? Or is or, or do like, you both have to die? Or how does this work? Well, he definitely is getting back up again, so I'm not sure if I, if I have to kill the one on his back, kill them all at the same time, or what. But as long as he's around, he's going to keep his brother alive. That seems to be the general consensus, anyway. We've entered phase two. The really gonna burn you up phase. Yeah, it's both at once. And now he has Aldrich's stupid missiles. I hate that. Keep that giant thing to yourself. Oh. And the, the younger brother fires magic at you. Uh, I'm not gonna enjoy this at all. Oh, it's like fighting Aldrich with more teleporting. Okay. You guys know the drill. I'll keep at it. I'll see you guys when I win. If I win.
Mamma Mia. Okay. Finally got through... I don't remember their names now. My goodness. The the princes. Oh my goodness. Did I just literally forget their names? Oh, that's not good. Um, uh, this is embarrassing. Um, when the princess soul is steeped in strength. Okay, hang on. No, not, not you. What are you doing? Uh, that one. Um, the, two, the two princes... Uh, the two princes rejected their duty to, to become lords of Cinder and settled down far, far away to watch the fire fade from a distance. A curse makes their souls nearly inseparable. I think it was Lorian, and I, I swear I knew his name. Um, started experimenting with uh, parrying rather than just attacking, which was actually kind of kind of fun for the first part of the fight. But in the end, I just ended up using using my my my, my historic greatsword. Is my brain seriously like? I, I keep I keep thinking Vendrick, but that's the second game, isn't it? Lothric. Prince Lothric. Yes, he was Pr Prince Lorian and Prince Lothric the Younger, is what it was. My goodness. Anyway, beating that boss. Gonna go catch in all these lovely, lovely souls of mine. And, um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, and uh, for now, you know, uh, take care of yourselves, you're worth it, and stay monstrous. Bye-bye! Oh, forgot the wave. Bye-bye! Uh,